Oh, wonderful. Annyeong everyone, this is Ju from Soju Cars and today I have the 2022 Hyundai Palisade VIP. This is higher trim from the calligraphy. This is the top, top variant here in the Palisade family. If you are new to the channel, please do consider subscribing. And if you are already a subscriber, thank you so much for watching. If you want to purchase this one, you can find Mr. RJ Mendoza here in Pit Stop Motors in Quezon Avenue. This unit costs 3.8 million, but let me show you why this vehicle costs that much. In our channel, we say Shija. The Palisade has a 2.2 liter four cylinder turbo diesel engine. This is an all wheel drive. It does about 2.2 horsepower at 3,800 RPM, 400. 40 newton meters of torque at 1750 to 2750 rpm this is the key to the palisade vip it is a smart key it's a glossy key uh it's not as luxurious as i would have imagined but it works and it also comes with automatic engine start or remote engine start and also trunk and other stuff right there let us start from the front fascia. Look at all this, the entire front face working together. So this is just one piece that is just uh, divided due to the bumper, but that makes it more interesting. A bit of chrome, more LEDs, lots of lights. It says here Hyundai full LED system. And the front fascia looks really scary and just look at that front grill like a diamond well they look like arrows pointing down but they do look nice and surely they make a big statement some silver metallic paint glossy the front radar is here and look at the under garnishing it has lots of grooves in it Everything under is flat. This is an all-wheel drive model. So that is also why this vehicle is a lot more expensive. Front sensors. There are no side sensors. Four eye sensors. All right. On the hood, nice grooves there. It's flat and round. This is also interesting. It, like it's bloated a bit which makes the car look bigger and more intimidating the windshield wiper some sensors there the tire this is the wheel area nice two-tone alloy wheel wrapped in Michelin the size is 24550 R20s and they come in ventilated disc braking system as you can see in the wheel well, it looks like it has some plastic, but uh, yes, it is plastic, but it is uh, painted in body color. The side mirror is mounted on the door panel. The LED uh, repeater also here, side repeater. Also with blind spot monitoring. The door handles are in metallic uh, brushed aluminum finish. Now, the only complaint I could have in this car is that the sensor is not available in the second row. It is available for the first rows, but not on the second row. Here on the side, we have some brushed aluminum accent as well. Everything is fairly flat. These areas are in gloss and these areas are in brushed aluminum. They are just covered with uh, plastic. This area is also in brushed aluminum. The roof rail all the way to the back, the gas cap, the rear braking system is also ventilated. Same size of the tires and wheels. Let's pop the hood and let's see the engine bay. Oh yes. They come with nice hydraulic struts, insulation, 
and a nice CRDI 16 valve engine cover. Now there's nothing special in this one, but this is a proven engine of Hyundai, which is also tuned properly for this nice unit. Also hidden very well is a front camera. And unlike your other Hyundais, there is actually a grill within the logo. While these areas are like super duper open and you can actually see the radiator. Let me show you the lighting system of the Palisade. Left, right, high beam, park light, headlight, hazard. Break. We are here in the rear of the Palisade. It's a full LED system also in the rear end. Now it's my first time to see actually this kind of badging or L, uh, label on the rear lamp. So I will demo the rear lighting system here. Reverse. There you go. The side mirror goes down, then left right it looks massive the spoiler shark fin antenna top mount brake light defogger with wiper the logo palisade emblem nice combination lamp also more lamps here this is in halogen wrapped in a reflector nice silver garnishing like uh, designed for like the mesh type you also have a camera here. It says H track right there. In Hyundai, all this system is called the H track system. This uh, black model looks nice when it is clean. You have dual mufflers. Let's see what's under. So the H track system. It is an all wheel drive system. There are four eye sensors. One, two, three, four. And uh, what can you say about the rear? Looks fantastic, right? Uh, since we are here, let us check out the power lift gate yes everything is in led even the lights for the the plate number and look at this these are the things that makes the, this car or this suv different this suv has plenty of white lighting that well i personally prefer then as you see there is even a tonneau uh, this is a seven seater and then you can also control them, adjust them electronically. You also have a 12 volt, some tying points. You also get this. You can adjust. Okay, you see, everything just started to come up. And we have USB charge ports as well, some cup holders on both sides. Air vents on top, nice LED cabin light, three point uh, seat belt, and look at the the quality of the ceiling. It's not just your average fabric. It is like Alcantara, and you see some microphones there because this one has a talk back function, so you can actually communicate with the driver and the passenger here on the third row which is perfect for the parents now if you buy this unit since this unit is a unit that is officially sold in korea you also get these goodies open the door <laughs> it's like look at that it's like a door handle so you open the door then what do you see in the goodies a lot of things you get a car duster you get a Travel pillow, multi-blanket, LED early warning device. It's a cover for the windshield. Get a service kit. Also a trunk organizer so you can actually install it here using some of this kind of points. 
Uh, you don't get these things when you buy here in local. In pit stop, they give you all this. And that is a good feeling when you get free stuff, right? So that's the entire box. Oh, there's also still plating here. And you also get this noodle type of uh, matting. It is also part of the package. All the other, uh, it says here, Peli Seide VIP car mat. So let's remove that first. So you get this noodle, a full size of this noodle type of matting, which is, you know, uh, actually not so cheap. And it is in, made in Korea. The entire third row folds flat. So the entire back is in hard plastic. It even says Palisade here. I don't think you can see it, but everything's rugged. So you can actually use this for your uh, cargo. Then the speakers are in Krell. The subwoofer is here. And let us try to put it up, but we might have to remove the, the tonneau first. You also have speakers there. Wow, and see that? This is the type of material. You see this? Ah, uh, fantastic. This is also a cover given by the pit stop. Pit stop is just giving everything for everyone who will buy this one. Wow. You get more storage here. Tire mobility kit. You don't get a spare wheel in this. We had some cargo case earlier, right? In the box. But you also get the cargo net. Another early warning device with the manual also a fire extinguisher Whoa. and you can actually store the tonneau here okay you can store the tonneau here that's interesting and this hook wow everything is just you know made for uh, convenience this one, if the third row is up, you can actually, I guess, uh, tie it on the headrest thing so it will not go down. If you are enjoying this uh, content, please do subscribe. If you are a subscriber, thank you so much for watching. Please do contact Mr. RJ Mendoza here in Pit Stop Motors if you want to purchase this one. This one starts at 3.8 million. With the tonneau removed, let us uh, put up the third row. Also on the right side. Yay. And let's see what it has to offer. Then you just have to do this manually. This one is uh, manual also in other premium, premium brands. This SUV has a lot of premium, premium attributes. Let's close it. Still a lot of cargo space, even the third row is up. Now let us check out the interior. This is the side mirror. You have LED repeaters, blind spot warning. It has a fully powered, and you also have a camera here, and also this. Now let me show you what does, what that does when you open the door. Oh, so this is a puddle lamp, and the hologram is actually under the door. You see that palisade? So the hologram thing is actually here. <laughs> Let us check out the door panel here in the first row. These are soft plastic, really soft to the touch. Brushed aluminum with two settings for the memory seats. Glossy design here. Now these are perforated leather. They are like kilted leather. I don't know if wind comes out from here, but it looks like wind will come out from there. More design, it's fuzzy, the feeling is fuzzy. All powered, fully powered. Nice leather. This must be Napa leather. This cream color bottle holder with some compartment with Krell sound system. Palisade step seal. All the seats here are VIP seats. Of course, they're airbag, they have knee support, lumbar support. They have all the power functions they can get, including the cooled seats and heated seats. Some controls here for the lighting, blind spot warning, lane keep assist, traction on and off, 
electronic parking brake and also the rear tailgate release fuse OBD hood release is here pedals and the steering wheel is uh, manually adjusted and it is telescopic though so maybe that's one thing they need to improve in the future model there's also a tiny Twitter speaker right here let's go inside this is the dashboard of the Palisade the steering wheel is wrapped in nice leather with adaptive cruise control audio system control it has paddle shifters in plastic it follows the steering wheel automatic lighting automatic windshield wiper oh yeah nice 10.25 inch screens here in the instrument and also in the uh, heads up uh, also here in the head unit uh, mind you that uh, this vehicle also has heads-up display. Uh, let me start the car. You see everything is in digital. And you can also see something there. Can you see it guys? There, I just turned on and off. The lights are in blue. Just the way I like it. When you turn on the aircon, it looks like this. Uh, nothing fancy though, but uh, it does have like uh, air circulation for clean air and it has dual zone, triple zone you also get uh, cooled seats and heated seats with steering wheel heat also brake hold different terrains let's see what happens if we change the drive modes later on so smart sport oh -ho. echo it's comfort and then if I change it to terrain, we have snow, mud, and sand. There, it will control everything on its own. How neat is that? And engine, auto, stop, and start. 360, nice compartment with adjustable cup holders so you can use more space when you don't use it for a cup you also get USB port and wireless charging pad here so if you want to use your cup holders just do that and you can also close it so it looks really clean and nice you also have some stuff down here with also uh, ambient light 12 volt another 12 volt and a nice compartment see that that is very unique the air vents are finished in brushed aluminum a really luxurious feel of the, the finishing now this area is also in leather uh, the push start button these are like soft plastic there is a speaker also then yes it comes so uh slowly which is nice but you get it's rare you find halogen lamp in this car but you find it in the uh, glove box also here in the center console uh, fast charge 12 volt and a big big compartment with nice leather uh top here for the armrest Auto dimming, room mirror. Okay, it's closed, but uh, there's a sunglass case. These are for like uh, Korean stuff, like SOS button and also like ETC. The controls for the sunroof here and the panoramic sunroof for the rear are here. Lights are nice in LED. And just look at this uh, material, it is so fuzzy lights that's on in led also mirror with led oh let's see if this oh yeah now these are attention to detail yes i love this function all automakers should buy this it's so cool just look at this look how nice the quality is <laughs> so that's the front after this uh easy walk-in feature that's really cool right 
So that is the VIP area. So we will go there and let's check out the car. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe for more. The passenger side in the first row doesn't get a lumbar support, which is a bit uh, unusual, but it is what it is. Let's go to the VIP row. You also get this kind of spaghetti mattings for all your seats. So pit stop is really giving everything that you will get when you order one in Korea. Let's start from the door panel. We have a nice speaker there. Brushed aluminum door handle. We have nice manual window shade. Cup holder, grill speaker. Nice leather, look at this. Really luxurious and also some design there. But what makes this car really up to date? You do get your wireless phone charger on the door panel. Not only here, but also there. So this vehicle comes with three wireless chargers. Come to think of it, it is not so expensive to do that. But to design it and to be able to engineer it that way, oh, that is another story. Now we're here in the VIP seat. You get nice ambient light also. Uh, this seat can be adjusted manually. Yes, this seat can be adjusted manually. And then we're here. Another uh, aircon system. Just turn it on. So it looks like, you know, the average, like a, you know, very conventional one. But these seats in the second row get ventilated seats and heated seats. 12 volt wall charger you have a pouch here it looks very luxurious because it's all wrinkled up that makes it really uh, expensive looking you also have a nice screen here you can actually turn it on here there you go is it a touch type it is a touch type so i can do that mirroring all this can be changed to English so don't worry about it so it is an Android unit that works really cool now what is this I'm not so sure but it has a lot of things so yeah and then what is this this is the air purification air clean mode so you can turn it on and off here oh and your drinks you can cook you can make it hot you can make it cold how cool is that right you can also control the individual media from here airbag the air vent nice individual lights and just look at this panoramic sunroof and look at the the headrest it is a very premium headrest that you can even control this one fantastic you also get something here just press this it's all in leather Get a nice light usb charge port two 3.5 jacks so that you can plug in your headphones individually and it is really soft so you don't get a center seat in this vehicle because this is a premium car so let's see how i can uh, access the third row so this must be the button that will do it in one snap oh it is electronic whoo Nice step seals with palisade. Let's access the third row. Just step on this and go inside. Yes, this one will not move, it will stay. Um, like I was expecting that there will be another button here so it will also open, but you only have it there, it seems. And then, so the seat here, the seat material is just the same. Uh, everything is in nice Napa brown leather and these are the amenities these are the places where you put the tonneau oh this is like another grab handle for you to climb inside oh that's a good idea more tie down and as you've seen this seat will fold uh automatically and how about this one what is this oh it is just for controlling oh and you can recline that much oh 
I can recline a lot. Let's see. Oh yeah. So I can also be comfortable here, but let's see. So if the front person only needs that much, then I'll have so much room. But I guess if it's uh, reasonable, maybe I will have this much of space. But it's okay. I don't think I'll be riding here on the third row anyway. I would rather drive this baby rather than being shuffled around. So that's it guys. I hope you guys are enjoying this video. Please hit that like button and contact Mr. RJ Mendoza here in Pit Stop. One of the rare places you find halogen lamps in this palisade. If I'm the owner, I will replace that. So from the rear, you can electronically fold the seats and look at the headrest. Yes, that is like one of the cool things that I like. And then you can also press this. And it folds flat so look how much cargo you can have you just need to cover that area so that it will not get dirty but this one will fold flat all the way and in this nice fuzzy durable material now let us check out functions here in the head unit a seat belt indicator for everyone radio whoa let's see how it changes whoa that's so old school oh it's the like the bulb type so you have plenty of things here you can also do like drive terrain mode that you have plenty of safety features in this car scc reaction driving convenience you see that lead vehicle departure alert okay this is the only one that I've seen aside from Subarus that has a lead vehicle departure alert. Oh, all right. Lane following assist, highway driving assist, highway auto speed zone slowdown, highway auto curve slowdown. Ho, 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 ho. Standard, late. Warning volume, driver attention warning, lane safety. So it can actually assist and steer the steering wheel when it sees, when it uh, senses that you're going out of the lane. <gasps> Parking safety. So it has a cross traffic uh, safety system. This one has Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. Passenger talk. So, yobuseyo, yobuseyo, yobuseyo. So what I'm saying here is being played there in the speaker. And there's actually a microphone there. You can also talk back so I can hear from this speaker here in front. Uh, you should experience this, it's really cool. Uh, reverse. There you go. Trajectory lines. Different views. There you go. And uh, this is like one of my favorite. Like turn left. There you go turn right it's so clear and it is so cool there's our palisade all right so there you have it guys that's the palisade starts at 3.8 million negotiable most probably please mention soju cars you have also a usb port here all right Thank you everyone for watching this video. This was Drew from Soju Cars. And yes, now you know why this car costs that much. But if you are going for the local one in the future, it will not have this kind of features. So what are you waiting for? Please do contact Mr. RJ Mendoza here in Pit Stop Motors. And don't forget to mention Soju Cars. And with that, I will see you in the next video. May your dream come true. Annyeong.